in this video i'm going to show you how can add product filter in elementor using which you can pro filter products using the price using categories and uh, using the option like which products are on sale and uh, you can select options which you can see filter products using like which products are in stock out of stock or back order uh, for example let me just uh, choose uh, choose this set to 25 which means that all of the products will be below 25 or 25 so i will just click on filter over here and you see that all of the products are below uh, 25 over here i can also uh, like below 15 i will set to 15 and let's see what happens okay so you see that all of these products are below 15 over here okay great so i'll just uh, set it to maximum and now i can use the categories to select uh, which one are for women you see that all of these products are for women over here all women products and you can also select which products are on in sale on sale you see that all of these products are in sale uh, 29.19 slashed out and the reduced price is 27.99 so okay so this is how uh, this is how the uh, uh, product filter works over here you can use to filter woocommerce products so i will just uh, now show you how you can add it to uh, product uh, shop page made with elementor okay so this is a shop page made with elementor and i am going to uh, add the product filter over here so just let me first show you uh, how you can do that you can you, you can do this by adding a free plugin okay not a paid plugin just a free plugin you can do it uh, just write to commerce product filter search for this and uh, see this is the one which i am using product filter by wubu okay so uh, install it and activate it and after you install and activate it uh, you are going to see this option over here wu product filter just click over here uh, what you need to do now is you need to add a new filter and customize it okay so i will need to click over here add new filter so give the filter name so i will name it element product filter and save it okay so uh, we'll need to choose the uh, like uh, parameters using which we are going to filter the products so price is one of them and product categories is another one of them mm, the product tax currently i don't have any product tax you can uh, use product tax if you are, have added it attributes uh, author featured on sale products stock status and also ratings like uh, like how many products have uh, ratings more than three star or five star uh, etc so these are the things so i'll add a couple more on sale stock status okay so this is the ones which i need so i'll just save it and it is saved so i'll just refresh this page because i uh, created the new filter okay so now what i have to do i will duplicate this i will delete this one set the column width to 25 and then i'm going to add this uh, i'll search for filter and i will add this who filters and add this to this column over here and i'll need to select the filter i will from the drop down select this filter uh, uh, elementor product filter things appear over here it gives a visual option too you can over here we have the price filter categories filter on sale filter stock status filter you can also remove uh, remove any one of them if you like here is a cross button so you can remove them so for now i will just click on save 
I will also click over save to for the good measure and then click on update again ok so now let's check out the shop page ok so this is the shop page now let's see if our product filter works so I'll set this to 25 and before that we see that uh, ok it's currently set to on sale I'll just filter ok so you see that over here uh, there is a product of, of uh, price of 29.44 ok so what I am going to do I am going to add uh, reduce the price to 25 and then filter and now what will happen is all of the product pricing over here uh, will be below 25 ok below 25 and then what I need uh, can do is uh, suppose I set it to back quit again and then I can also filter using categories over here I can select woman so now you see all of the women uh, products are uh, showing up if I check accessories then all the accessories products are showing up over here so uh, this is how easily the products work so make sure that you have uh, categories added to the products and you can also check on sale over here and it will only show up the show the on sale products which are on sale see 29.99 slash doubt and 27.99 okay uh, it will you can also use it to show switch, show products which are out of stock back order etc so this is how it works and ok so this is uh, how simple it is and this is how it works you see so the name of the plugin is who product filter and it is free to use and it's got a lots of good ratings ok I will just show it to you plugins install plugins so you can edit via shortcut and if you have Elementor you can edit just like I showed you so uh, this is the view details and you see that it's got a 183 ratings which are which is a very good 5 star 173 5 star ratings okay so it's a very good uh, plugin and you can easily use it to add product filters uh, in our wordpress website so i hope this video helped you out and if it did then make sure to like this video